part of the responsibility of a school is to say we taught and now we've assessed and this is what the child has achieved. If you haven't identified what they're supposed to achieve, which skills they're supposed to master, and you haven't assessed it, so what are you teaching for it? If in the world of education there is an idea that can help children achieve in the world of Jewish education as well, then how can we deny the children that opportunity? Standards focus on getting the child to become a literary, astute, independent Chumash learner. It's not merely about covering ground and learning another partial of Chumash or learning another page of Gemara. But what is it that I want the students to be able to accomplish with this page of Gemara? The standards cover everything from which vocabulary, language skills, which uh, Russian, which prefixes, which suffixes should be highlighted and focused on in any given year, how to sequence the events of a story, how to compare and contrast various texts within the Chumash. Students need to learn how to notice the anomalies within the Chumash. These are the things that the commentaries, the Rashi and the other Mephorshim, are regularly analyzing this text in a similar way. So we're really giving them the skills and the tools to appreciate and to understand how the Mephorshim view a Pasuk and Chumash. Master teachers attested to the fact that the standards gave them a focus for their teaching, that the assessments enabled them to know where every child was vis-a-vis -vis in relationship to these standards, that the growth and the development and the ability for children to ultimately become independent learners was enhanced using the Zeckelman standards. We have children now receiving specialized interventions to help them overcome their learning challenges in the first grade and second grade only due to the fact that we have a standard-based curriculum and assessments that are aligned to those standards that enable us to truly gauge and see where every child is holding in relation to the meeting of those standards. Now, for a school to adopt these standards and to begin teaching standard-based is not something that happens overnight. There's a commitment that's needed, starting with administration. The schools need to be willing to invest mostly their time, their energy, and they need to be committed. The Menachem Education Foundation saw the need and literally rose to the occasion to provide a forum, a funding, to see the Zakumim Chumash standards, the Zakumim Gemara standards come to fruition and become a reality. The Zakumim standards for Judaic studies have been generously endowed by Mr. Allen and Lori Zakumim of Detroit, Michigan. The Zakumims are passionate advocates for Jewish education. It is their vision to see that our children receive the highest caliber of instruction and learning. The Standards Project works to create educational excellence in schools and communities across the country. Through implementing these standards, we are securing a bright Jewish future and ensuring that our children achieve their best.